Tha igiri nanudhu wafishine nene shiothu dhuri ya DCI Farafara ya kiabu Uri ya wale minister wogi thiri wa dheni ya dagitari Fred Matiangi Eki nye au metuwa dhuda ni arumiriri Udomwe na mawakiri mega tofroline Matogoretio ni wakiri Dunstan Nomari Otiende omolo Nage No dhuda wa dagika iku minaidhano Uka umiragi shaja maja washi karoishi Dhuda wa maofitha DCI Kugiri ya maigere mari ove No metekiri ya matiangi aigere na mawakiri aketu Dhake da shiaho wa ini Kishaja mota kiaro shine gige shokera Dhuda wa mtu ogoli ya wagu wataniro ya zimiyo la umoja raila odinga kugirio kuigira Be able to see people and give reasons All that I'm demanding are reasons why Matiang is being held here And that information can only be given to me by the senior officer inside here And they refuse to access At first they told me to get out of my car, that I, I should, I'm going to walk down to the offices. I've come out of my car, I've come to the gate here. It's now nearly th 30 minutes. Dhuda wa madha manana wa afishi na ishio, mawakiri ma mati yangi, maugete gotire mahiti ya nyite to na mo, dhegia wako adekiru wa mahiti ya mere. Kuhea na deto shitari na o mashigi ya mugoro liyo lia kule erikana, wahane kire tariki nyanya mweri mohetoku. No hotheri moru wane da shio kinyaneria. The son of Omogusi, Dr. Fred Matiangi is a free man with us here. We, we came, we brought him here to demonstrate to Kenyans that uh, Dr. Fred Matiangi is a law-abiding citizen. The questions they were asking were related to his properties, And we completely advised the, the CS not to respond to anything outside what the summons were. We advised the CS to invoke Article 49 to remain silent and not to answer anything. Let the point be made here, and we made it to them, that it's clear that this was not a criminal investigation. This was vendetta and witch hunt. It is also clear that the DCI were not acting of their own motion. It is clear that they are awaiting instructions on what to do with Dr. Matiangi. That is very clear to us and we told them as much. Oh, maugete ruguru wa madha manana ali wafishi inaishio matiangi ya hogiru wa maholida geka ikomi na idhano tu na isho ige meko higireto nyoba ya gotafaniri ya mishemanio the DCI detained Dr. Matiangi and us as the lawyers for those many hours because we do not have the leave to leave. It is only much later that then now they came with a cautionary statement charging our client, uh, saying they intend to charge him under Section 23 of the Computer Cyber Crimes Act and Section 317 of the Penal Code. What he did for our education we know. What he did for our ICT and digitization of communication, we know. What he has done for our uh, uh, rather security, we know. And then a person of this nature, with so much institutional memory, can be subjected to injustices of this magnitude. Moriti ya ruhogeru wa dhudhulia, rutafani ya dhudhulia wao na ajira ya oma na waragania, guko makiuga, mehaliri ya gutuwa ramati ya ngihede oyo the, ego fataru wa kuhugo maholi makeria. Dhudha wa ruhogeru wa dhudhulia DCI, kuhuga maholi yoli ya wale minister wogiteri wa theni ya dagitari Fred Matiangi, li umaidho mothe marorete mwerekera uli ya mekwa ya, kuligane no dhudhulia na uirole ya mariketie kurogota kumana na wirosho. Gerifo Tarinoro TV, kuma wafishine neshia DCI farafara ya kiabu, tatagua jenga kwa boi.